made with love and hopefully no spit. I'm not very happy about this. It's five degrees, it's not a clock. Not a fun five, not a high five, just five. No scraper, it's just powder. Don't really need a scraper, but hands are already cold. My hands are already really cold. I shouldn't have bought a metal tripod. The rest of me is alright. I think this is the first snow down here in Pueblo. I don't know, I'm never here so I don't know. But it's the first snow I've seen down here this year. We've had two or three in Boulder already. Hey <laughs> guy. I don't wear a coat, and like today, I'm not cold, my body's not cold when I'm out there. My arms aren't cold, short sleeve shirt. My hands, whew, my hands get it. I try to make myself cold blooded for the winter so that it doesn't bother me as bad, and it works. I don't have to uh, wear a big burly coat when it's cold out like this. If I put on a long sleeve shirt, I'm pretty good. In the house. 1100 square foot house. That's my heater. That's the only heater. It's five outside. And my thermometer says, feels like 60 in here. My thermometer's off a little bit, so I would say it's probably, I don't think it'd be less than 55 in here. It's perfect sleeping weather. I slept great last night, and that's how it should be. But this puts a damper on everything. It's hard to grout because I can't wash my buckets out outside. It'll freeze before I can even. Anyway, I'm warming the truck up. I'm gonna go to Lowe's. I'm gonna go get something to eat for breakfast. And then I'm gonna go to Lowe's, and get a faucet and drain pipe. That's about it. I just remembered this truck is two wheel drive. I hope the roads aren't snowed over. Cause I won't even make it up the hill outside my driveway. Uh oh. Well, let's see. That's the worst is when you get to the top of the hill and you start sliding. Then you get to slide all the way down backwards. We made it. Good. Two wheel drive, no air conditioner, but it has a dump bed. Totally worth it. I feel like Sonic today. <laughs> That's just a, uh, it's not a nice thing to do to people. Going to Sonic, having the car up after come out and give you food. It's just not, nice, not, not a nice thing to do. There's one up here that has a drive-through, luckily. I think Sonic it is. And I finally shaved my neck too. That was getting, uh oh. That was getting a wee bit. And I'm sliding. So this slick. I was getting a wee bit uh, disgusting. Oh, it is slick. I stand corrected. I don't know if you can hear it on the video. I feel like there's a whistle under my truck. It does it when I get up to about 40. So I'm gonna listen to it. I'm gonna stay down below 40. Maybe it's trying to tell me something. Or it's gonna blow up. But either way. Stay down below it. I don't even think they're open. No, they're open. Apparently, nobody that works here drives a car. Please don't spit in it because I came on a cold day. I feel a warm climate coming on very soon. The cold sucks. Made with love and hopefully, no spit.
stopped at Home Depot. Didn't have much of anything at Lowe's for tile that was remotely cost effective. So I'm buying some tile. So I got this mosaic for my backsplash. Five bucks a piece. I had to figure it out because it didn't say it on the box, but it's about five sixths of a square foot. So six bucks a square foot, I think is the math. People are looking at me like I'm a mental patient because I'm in a t-shirt. If there's anything wrong with being a mental patient, just uh, observation. Got a faucet, brush nickel, 30 bucks. I got this deal. This just chaps me because, well, I'm a guy. So to buy crap like this is annoying. I, I'm perfectly acceptable to putting a roll of toilet paper on the back of the toilet. I don't need one of these little things. That said, I bought it anyway. I don't know why. I looked down the aisle, looked for the cheapest one I could find other than the wood ones. I hate the wood ones. This is a $48 expense that pisses me off. The ones that I had in here are the old chrome ones. They're rusty and I tried, I tried to clean them. I tried to use them again, but I had to buy this. This is this is home decor. This goes right up there with buying curtains and pot holders. What else is crap that I don't want to buy? Area rugs. Just bugs me. But I bought it. Whatever. It's done. It'll look nice. Sink hoses. Sink tailpiece, drain, stopper, a bunch of escutcheons, jar of plumber's putty. There's a tub of this in this house somewhere. I looked all over this morning and I couldn't find it. I also have several other tubs of this in the storage unit, which are probably ruined by now because they've been frozen, I guess. I don't know. Escutcheons. Everybody know what escutcheons are? That's an escutcheon. That's a after the installation escutcheon. There's a big escutcheon. Escutcheon, I want to say that escutcheon would be the, if things were football players, go with me here. If things were football players, let's say truck and house and couch were football players, they'd be the linemen, linebackers, linemen. Because they're big, they're big, they're big items. And then you have escutcheon and he's a little guy, he's 4'11", 103 pounds. His name on the back of his jersey goes elbow to elbow because he's too small, Escutcheon. And now coming onto the field, the kicker, number 0.5, Escutcheon. I don't know why they have to have such a big word for such a small piece, that's what I'm getting at. Valve, that's a small piece, small word. Nail, screw, nut, bolt, Escutcheon. I'm just saying. Just doesn't seem right to have a word that big for something that small. What do they call him in high school? Scutch? That works. Scutch. Starsky and Scutch. things I've installed and I did not remember that these came with a tailpiece. I just confused the crap out of myself. I opened this box, I pulled that out, and then I just pulled this out and I said, hey, wait a minute. I thought I was opening the faucet box. The tailpiece is sitting over there. Ah, oh, it comes with a tailpiece. $30 isn't looking so bad now. So now I get to take that thing back. This is why I didn't install the sink yet. Because crawling under there to put the faucet in, Sucks. It sucks. What does it do? It sucks.
decided to go ahead and put the tile backsplash in. This will be my first backsplash I've ever done. I'm guessing tile's tile, so we'll see how it goes. Hopefully it's not a mess. This is gonna be a mess. Here we go. I had a heck of a problem with that side. The countertop was off the wall, so it didn't have anything to hold the tile up. So they started sliding down behind it. Got it figured out with some sheet metal and a little bit of counterweight. I think it's gonna look all right. Get those two pieces put in. Didn't take that long either. I thought it'd take a lot longer. It's pretty easy actually, except for that side. That sucked. <laughs> 